guys, it's Amy and welcome to a brand new episode of Doggy Tales! The series where we get to hang out with a bunch of awesome doggos and talking about doggos, or should I say foxes, meet Todd. The latest addition to our family. Hey doggy little cutie patootie, Todd joins myself, Bailey and of course Max. Now we found Todd in the last episode, but also in the last episode we did a whole bunch load of decorating and I've been doing a little bit more off camera check it out this is our new kitchen doesn't it look amazing we even have cookies I sure do love cookies <gasps> nom, 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 nom. we also have like a little living room area over here but as you can see it needs a little bit more work now on the top floor is my bedroom this floor is obviously like the community room so I was thinking the ground floor should be for the doggos. We could have a whole bunch load of doggy beds and doggy food and doggy toys. What do you guys think of that? <laughs> I know, right? That's like the best idea ever. So I will get round to that soon. But for now, we need to work on an animal farm. That way we'll have lots of lovely coloured wool to play with. Hmm, I don't really have enough wood to begin making some paddocks. So I guess I'm going to have to go outside and get shopping. Look, Mum, I made an axe. I'm just a genius. Okay, the other thing we are going to need is diamond wolf armor. And now we just gotta pick a doggo or foxo, sorry Todd, to take with us on today's adventure. Now actually, you know what? Last episode, I think we did have Todd. And Max, you've been with me since day one. So Bailey, do you wanna come with me today, buddy? <laughs> Oh, of course you do. Alrighty then, now I've got to put this armor on you, Bailey. That way you'll be super protected. Ah, now don't you look lovely, just like Listerine mouthwash. This video is not sponsored by Listerine. Alrighty then, Bailey, now let's head out to the woods. Phew, I am exhausted. That took forever. I'm lying, it really didn't. Look, my house is right there. Ha, <laughs> loves it. Alrighty then, now let's get shopping. Oakwood. I think that will be plenty. Now, guess what we've got to do now, Bailey? <coughs> um, no, not make pizza. We've got to replant those tree babies. Because we want the forest growing big and strong. Loves it. Alrighty then. Look, even more tree babies. How wicked. Alright, let's get planting. And perfect. Look at all of those tree babies we planted. And we have one more sapling left, Bailey. Do you want to find a place to plant the last one? <coughs> You want to plant it over here, boy? That's a great spot. Well done, Bailey. We've always got to remember to take care of nature. And now that's done, let's start on those paddocks. We're going to need to make a whole bunch load of fences. Look at all of the fences we made. That should be enough for now. Awesome. Alrighty then, so now we've got to pick the perfect place for our animal farm. And I was kind of thinking we should do it just beyond our food farm. What do you think, Bailey? Is this a good place for our farm animals? <coughs> I agree. I think they'll love it here. Alrighty then, now let's get building. That looks pretty good to me, Bailey. Now we get to do the fun part and find ourselves some animals. We're gonna need to get ourselves some wheat and some wheat seeds. <coughs> What's that, Bailey? <coughs> oh, carrots, you're right. Piggies love carrots. So we got ourselves some carrots, some wheat, and some seeds. Okay, Bailey, now which way do you think we need to go to find some animals? <coughs> you think this way? Alrighty then, buddy. Let's see what we can find. <laughs> Cow 
right here. Hey, buddy. Would you like to join us on our farm? You would? Awesome. Now follow me. Yeah, we got our first cow. Now I don't want you to be lonely, little buddy. So I'm going to go find you a friend. Hey, check it. Another cow. And look, this one doesn't have a ring through his nose. Do you think the other one was some kind of bull? Would you like to come and live with us too? <laughs> great, follow me. Ah, uh, they already love each other. Look at them give each other a great big huggle. So super cute. Now let's see if we can find any more animals. Hey, check it out, Bailey. Look, there's a sheep in that tree over there. Maybe he'll want to join our family too. Hey, cutie, you want to join our family? <laughs> of course he does. Come with me, Mr. Sheeples. And welcome to your new home, cutie. And meet your neighbors. Oh my goodness, I love these little farm animals. Oh, but you know what? We should get some name tags for you guys. Now we can craft name tags pretty easily. All we need is some golden nuggets and some string. And luckily, we have plenty of gold and plenty of string. Hmm, now what to name these animals? Oh wait, I've got the best names ever. Let's name Boy Cow Mr. Moo. Lady Cow will be Mr. This is Moo, and Sheepy will be Cloudbutt. Best names ever! There you go, Cloudbutt. <laughs> I dig it. Did you see that little nod he gave us? He loves his name. But you know what? We do need to get Cloudbutt a friend. But let's name our Moo cows. Okay, we have Mrs. Moo. There you go, Mrs. Moo. And we also have Mr. Moo. <laughs> loves it. This is awesome. And you know what would be really cool right here? A giant barn. What is it, Cloudbutt? Are you thirsty? Alrighty then, let me get you some water. And check it out, we can actually make a trough. That would be awesome. So all we need is some iron, some oak wood, and some sticks. And there it is, wicked. And here you go, Cloudbutt. Let me just add some water. Awesome. Oh, he really was thirsty. Look how cute that is. Oh, Cloudbutt, you are the cutest butt in the whole entire universe. Okay, now let's get some water for those cows. And there you go, Mr. and Mrs. Moo. Drink up now. Wait, Mr. Moo, you can't stand in your water trough. That's silly. And look at Cloudbutt. He is literally just hanging out in his water trough. You guys. Guys, that's not very hygienic, is it, Mrs. Moo? Exactly, she knows what's up. Okay, now would be great to find a friend for Cotton Butt before the end of the episode. Ah, oh, now here's another little sheepy. Hey, buddy, you want to join our family too? Of course she does. Who wouldn't want to join our family? All right then, buddy, now let's go. And our new sheepy is home. Now all we need is a name for her. I sure am hungry, though. Okay, now this also may be one of the greatest names ever. We're going to call her Barbara. <laughs> I loves it. Hey, check it out, a piggy. And look at those precious ears. Yes, you're cute too, Bailey. But look at him. Ah, Okay, piggy, you need to come with us. And there you go, little piggy. Welcome home. I'm sorry you have to share with the sheepies, but I'm sure they will be great roommates. Okay, wait. Why do I have three sheepies? Did you guys have a baby? Oh my goodness, that's adorable. Okay, uh, Barbara, there is your name. That means we're gonna need to name this little fella. And wait a minute. There's three cows in here now. Look at this little baby. Oh my goodness, look how tall his legs are though. That's hilarious. Wow, you guys, what a great episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a big pause up if you did. Also, check out www.amily33.co.uk for some wicked cool official Amy Lee merchandise. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Good.